What is up my fellow techies? Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. You know what? Happy Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa. That should cover everybody. And with those words, you know what that means. CES 2025 is here. The Super Bowl for us tech nerds. The chance to see what new tech and gadgets await us in the months and years to come. Some we can't afford, some that we'll never see a light of day. But hey, it's great to see what is out there. Now, every year I take a look at what the major players are expected to showcase at CES. And if you wanna stay up to date with what CES has in store, then you've landed at the right place. Do me a huge favor, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, and hit that like button if you enjoy this type of content. All right, let's jump into this. If you're an AMD fan, this one's going to be spicy. Today, we're diving into everything you can expect from AMD's upcoming announcements, from next-gen GPUs to cutting-edge CPUs. Buckle up, because AMD is aiming big this year, and we're here to break it all down. First up, let's talk about the star of the show for AMD, the RDNA 4 GPUs. Lisa Su herself teased that RDNA 4 will deliver significantly higher ray tracing performance and new AI capabilities. Rumors suggest that Radeon RX 9070 XT will pack a punch with a 3.1 gigahertz boost clock and 330 watt total board power. That's like giving your GPU a caffeine shot and telling it to run faster than Usain Bolt in a 100 meter dash. It appears AMD will skip naming the new cards RX 8000 and jump right to the RX 9000 because bigger numbers seem cooler, right? Now, if you're sitting there thinking, wait, wasn't ray tracing AMD's Achilles heel with their RX 7000 series? You're not wrong, but RDNA 4 is looking to change the game. Remember, these GPUs are not just about raw power, they're also set to significantly boost ray tracing capabilities, something AMD has been catching up on. And let's not forget, they're piling on new AI capabilities to make FSR 4 a real contender against Nvidia's DLSS. But how will it stack up against DLSS4? We shall see. Rounding out the rest of the list of expected GPUs from AMD are the 9060, 9050, and 9040. AMD will have every gaming budget accounted for. But wait, it's not all GPUs. AMD's Ryzen CPUs are also still in the spotlight. The Ryzen 9 9950X3D is leaked with a jaw-dropping 5.65 GHz boost clock and 170 watts of power draw. This chip is aimed squarely at gamers who demand nothing but the best. And if that's not enough, there's also the Ryzen 9 9900X3D for those looking for a top tier performance without the flagship price tag. If you're into gaming or content creation, these chips promise to deliver top tier performance. The 9950X3D in particular is shaping up to be the new darling for gamers looking for that sweet spot of high clock speeds and efficiency. And let's not forget the mobile side of things. AMD is also expected to showcase the Strix Halo laptop APUs and Ryzen Z2 chips for handheld gaming devices. If you're a portable gaming fan, 2025 could be the year for you. The Strix Halo is expected to be a powerhouse, potentially rivaling discrete GPUs in its integrated graphics. The integration of RDNA 4 into these APUs could mean better gaming performance enhanced by ray tracing and those juicy AI capabilities we keep hearing about. Should Nvidia be sweating right now? Absolutely. Should you start saving for an AMD upgrade? Maybe. CES 2025 will be the proving ground and sparks and fireworks will fly. Mark your calendar folks, January is going to be wild. What do you want to see from AMD at this year's CES show? Let me know down in the comment section. Once again, thank you for taking the time out to watch this video. If you're new to this channel and want to stay up to date with the latest CES news, then this is the spot for you. Make sure you do me a huge favor. Hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, and if you enjoy this type of content, hit that like button as well. Now, if you have friends or family that want to stay up to date with the latest CES news, make sure you share that with them as well. And for even more tech news in video form, check out one of these videos right here. And until next video, guys, stay nerdy.